it's Briar Chart here and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. So today I picked up the Mystery Full Surprise little stable mate set. Uh, I was in Tractor Supply for the first time. We just recently got one in my area and I was finally able to go stop by there and they were having 40% off um, all like their toys and that included Briars. So I decided to pick these guys up. There wasn't that large of a selection, which actually is kind of good because that means that they sold a lot during Christmas. So they'll be able to order more next year for Christmas and get the tractor supply specials again, more specifically because I usually like at least one of them every year, but they had a classic set or just a classic model. And then they had three of these stable mate sets, but one of them, was this version of it and I think they had two Stellas left which I was pretty surprised about that and then just some like full sets oh yeah there's a full set with the barn there was a few of those actually I was really tempted because I love the um folds in it but I didn't need a barn um and they also had the glow in the dark models which are actually kind of cool and I kind of want to go back and get them because now thinking about it, it is a pretty cool idea. But I already have so many stalemates. That's actually on my plan today is to organize all of my stalemate shelves and stuff and get that all figured out because I have way too many. Yeah, let's just get into unboxing them and I'll give you a little review, I guess. So this uh, series has three versions of it. It's, I don't know what series it is, but if there even is a series, I don't know. But I picked up, there was two of these specifically. Um, one, the paint had like weird black marks on it. Okay, I'm trying not to look at the full, but it's probably gonna end up happening anyway. All right, they're getting pushed out from the bottom. Okay, I do not want to know who the full is, but I might, oh wait, I don't have to look, okay. Okay, so first guy out, I just need to, get these off. I did damage him a little bit, which is really my fault. I scraped the hoof, but it's a really, oh, it's not your picture. It's a really easy fix because it's like on the black. So I'm good. I can fix that up really easily, but wow, I really like this. Mo oh, there's a made in China sticker. Okay. I'll, I'll get that off eventually, but he's really cute. I really like this mold. It's just like really nice. There is some overspray in the main, but I feel like that's very common. He has a cute little blaze and yeah, he's really nice. I don't see that many flaws on him. Okay, let's get the little mom out next. I'm assuming, yeah, that's, that one's the mom, the paint's the mom. Again, I'm really trying not to look at the thing, the full. So this is kind of, oh, I kind of saw him, dang it. Uh, okay, let me... Oh, I didn't want to see the full that I like kind of hard. I don't know what mold it's on, but I do know the color at this point. All right, I feel like we're just gonna have to get the thing out because there's no way I'm not gonna see it. So let's see what full we got. I'm just gonna, wait, I'm closing my eyes. I swear I'm closing my eyes and I'm just putting them on the side. You guys have no clue, but I doubt you really care that much if I'm cheating or not. Okay, after enormous struggle, this girl is out and I really like the little spotting on it. I don't know how realistic that is, honestly. It probably is. I feel like they wouldn't make it that unrealistic model, but I don't really know. But she's really cute. I love this mold. I don't know why, I've just always liked it. Uh, the markings are pretty nice. There's not that many flaws from what I could see. Honestly, her markings are pretty crisp. The only real flaw I could see is that there's like a little black mark right there and you can't even see it and I could probably get it off. But she's really nice. I really like her and I kind of want to add her to my mini show strings. I don't really have, I don't think I have any off paints. I might have like one. So she might be adding to my show string. Okay, now let's look at the fool who I do not know who it is. I swear I didn't look. Okay, well now I'm looking. So, oh, uh, cute. Okay, I actually like this combination. It definitely like shows that it's from the mom and dad. And it's a nice little mix of them with the dad's coloring and then the paint markings. And oh my gosh, so cute. I love this guy. I'm a really big fan of this mold. I just think it's super cute. I think I have a common now of them because I have three or four at this point. 
Awesome. Yay. I'm really happy with this guy. He's super cute and just tiny and adorable. I love Stablemate Foals just because like they're a little bit bigger than Mini Winnie's but still like something to them. Flaws wise, markings are pretty crisp. I can't really complain too much about that. There were a little bit of like black dots but I've seemed to just like wipe them off and they were gone. So pretty happy with that. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this little quick unboxing. I just thought I'd share this quick little video with you since I was getting them anyways. Uh, let me know what you guys think of these guys in the comments for you. Uh, if you have any of the other sets, do you like the full? I genuinely did not know what the full was, so it's a lot more exciting when you don't know. I guess that's one little perk of me being pretty absent from the hobby for quite a few months from being in college. But yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like if you did. Follow me on Instagram at xxbriartrot. And yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And most importantly, stay fabulous. Bye!